Well, what a dog's dinner I made of these calipers. I guess this is a how not to do it video. So I began by painting these in VHT silver, which looks absolutely fine. I ended up just going for what I had on the shelf in the end. So this stuff was great. It was silver, really nice finish. And then decided quite late at night, actually, do you know what? I don't want silver because then they're going to show behind the wheels too much. And I just want a really nice, clean lines on the car so i decided to route around in the garage see if i had any vht in black i didn't so i used some hammerite smooth instead got a pretty decent finish on them but then just got carried away and ended up painting the insides as well which is ridiculous because you'll never ever see them and then after having done that i thought i'd pop them in the oven just to see if A, I could bake them dry a little bit for more durable finish and just see how well they withstand paint, um, the, sorry, the heat, how well the paint withstands heat. And they just started to bubble, uh, not particularly badly. That The calipers, the main calipers are fine, but these you can see here, all that's happened is to strip the um, paint, the uh, black hammerite paint off of the finish of them to expose of course the VHT paint not a surprise because that is high temperature paint and yeah just a bit of a mess so now I'm just going to end up stripping them all the way back with some paint stripper and maybe just have them blasted and just give them a light coat of black VHT instead so yeah a little bit of a waste of time all of that I should have just thought ahead a little bit Got some black VHT rather than being a little bit tight and just using what was on the shelves. I've got so many uh, different paints here and then realised, ah, oh, look, that all along I did have some black VHT paint as well. So bit of a mess there, a bit of a mess. Start all over again.